Hello, this is Q Doma. Welcome to another episode of Q Doma TV. Well, this afternoon we're going to go down a trip down memory lane of all the comments that Q Doma has received over the past few years about his videos. Now we're going to start with probably one of the first, but not the exact first. We're going to start with uh, the one in 2009. Now this comment was uh, a reply to the comment on Michael Jackson impersonator Carlo Riley. Okay. This was sent to me by a idol 194 uh, promo for Michael Jackson looking like a personator. I guess basically this has something to do with a comment or something I left a while back. Nothing negative, mind you. As you can you see right here, as you can see right there definitely the next one we're going to go to is uh, my comment on what is a buddy it was left by a Frio in milk and that comment was wow nigger as you can see right here this person right here is a uh, a white male and he has a child in tow. Of course, you know, mind you, when it comes to uh, things of this nature, mind you, I don't, uh, I don't take personal offense against any type of uh, wording, even if it may be uh, referred as negative. I find it quite hilarious. My question is, I wonder if his wife knows or even that, if that's even his picture. Frio, what as a Milko, or whatever your name is. Thanks for the comment. Alright. Next comment we have here. Okay, this, this goes into the year uh, 2010. 1-14-10. It's by a Mykari, Mykarkin23. And I think I left a, a reply on there about whatever, and it says that you should go see the movie. As you can see, this guy right here, he looks like he's some type of uh, musician of some type. Next person we're going to go to is uh, Becca Loves Bailey. And uh, they made a comment about the yeah, buddy. And uh, they left laugh out loud. You're awesome. I love you. Well, I love you too. Becca loves Bailey. And thanks for the comment. Definitely. Keep them coming. Even though it's been quite some time since, I, since this person has sent me a reply. But I definitely appreciate the comment. Next person sent me uh they sent me a comment on something uh, I think it's uh the it was an Asian movie I saw called Chocolate. And then basically they just said laugh they just like put laughed out loud. You know. And that was sent by uh a ton I think this what was this a ton ton and strun. I don't know if I got that right. I suck with names people. Ton and stun, I don't know. African American, black male, whatever you want to call it. You know, I definitely take your laugh out loud with strides. Now we're gonna go, we're gonna go, we're gonna go to another one. Right here, um, got another little comment. This was a reply back to turning the hands of time. I think it was a comment. I said something about um, aging or something. It said, if you'd like to embed this video, basically I think it was something with, I don't know, 
Dr. Abra D. Gray. You know, they say, what if God doesn't allow, oh, let's say, what if God doesn't allow, idiot. I, you know what, I later found out, you know, this comment right here. I don't think it was, maybe it was not intended for me. I don't know, it's been so, it's been so long. It was in 2010, it's hard to say. So we just going to put a question mark on that one. You know, I'm just showing the comments so, you know, so y'all don't think I'm making this up. You know, so we're just going through everyone. Uh, this one right here, I don't know, regenerating bodies. The key to repairing an outside tissue growing new organs could be physical, could be a physical focus. Um, I think this was some, some comment. The comment was, was spooky. And as you can see, we have a this guy right here, interesting fellow, right as you can see. Um, very true. It could be very, very spooky. Very, very spooky. Um, of course, and we have one of my favorite people here. And religion versus, I mean, actually, fact versus religion. Good old Thunderfoot. Yeah. Good old Thunderfoot. Uh, UFOs are unidentified fine objects since they are mainly perfectly ordinary things in the atmosphere that may, may not be unidentified. Yes, UFOs are really. Uh, yes, UFOs are really alien spacecraft. No, do I think they're ghosts? Do, no, do I think ghosts are real? No. Okay, I guess uh, pretty much the answer to that. I guess in a nutshell, she. I guess she was saying yours are real. Are, are, are real. Okay, that. Okay, she does believe in. Wait a minute. No. Okay, I think that's a no. I think that yeah, that's a no. That's a no on that. I'm having a hard time keeping up with the volume of mail I'm getting, so I'm going to try to answer some of the questions. Okay. Yeah. But uh, this was definitely a comment from good old Thunderfoot, and I definitely appreciate your comments. You're one of the realest people out there. Literally, you know, I have not seen any of your newest stuff lately. I should check it out, you know. I think if we ever met, I think we would be probably the best of friends, you know, definitely. Kudos to you and everything you're doing. Um, next one. Uh, this this one right here was a, this was a reply part one of part two vegetarian rat. Uh, yeah. This says I. Okay. This one says I'm a vegetarian. I actually bought my dog up as a vegetarian too. She's never tasted non-vegetarian. Human food, and she loves it. Though it's harder to, okay, da 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 da, yada yada. You know, this really may be offensive to some carnivores. Interesting thing about this, you know, right here. I mean, this guy—he's just giving his view, you know, which is cool. I mean, he's, you know, he's cool. I mean, it's one of it's it's a. Uh, it's another book. It's another. It's another video by uh, Thunderfoot. Of course, uh, I guess this was somebody who I had replied to a while back or whatever. You know. Cool. You know, I'm not a vegetarian myself. I eat meat. You know, I don't have nothing against vegetarians. They cool people. Just don't. Um, just don't down me for eating meat. You know. Um, next comment is from a 092609. Uh, reply comment with the Street Fighter, you know. They said probably they're going to make a super duper Street Fighter and put 10 more characters. Oh, yeah, no, they always do that. Lo and behold, look where we are now. They got Street Fighter the Arcade Edition. They did it a few years ago, backhand, and now we got it. Now we have it again, you know. And uh, I would love to thank you for your comment, uh, 092609. You know, definitely thanks for that.
Awesome. Always. Uh, okay, going, going, going here. Now the one we we have here is uh, Mortis Eight. You know, uh, they their reply on my comment was uh, the Sleeping Giant. They are both. They said they are both. They are both a re religion. Very little else. Hope that helps. Uh, I was kind of disappointed, but just how few people understood the Sleeping Giant reference. Okay. I guess that was something else I left, you know. Thank you for your comment, Mortis8. Definitely very helpful. No photo, but you know, I can deal with that. Alright, um. Next one I got here. This one, um. Was from, uh. I think this is Necropolis. The Neop. I can't even pronounce this. Anyway, um, another installment in the mystery is the quest to reveal who Veronica really is. All calls were to real people. Hmm. Veronica Sessions 689. Donations for the 13th Tribe of Satan. I found this to be most amusing. Definitely. If you get a chance, check out the video, people. Uh, here's another one, Bobby, oh, Bob Bit, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero, commented on my Exorcist Relief, this, is this Bill Cosby, uh, you know, I love your comment on that, we saw a black guy on the History Channel that was apparently possessed, it was so funny, we had to do a bit on it, yes, I had to do a bit on it. It was a must. I had to. It just it needed to be exposed. Definitely. We definitely appreciate your comment, Bob Bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. Definitely. Next comment we're going to um is a reply from X U X O six six six. And it's about the Gary Coleman is dead. And good until all of, the, all of them are used. You know, um, I don't, I think he wrote something in a different language there. I don't know if it was good or bad, but I'm just going to go, go on and hope it was good, you know. I made my own subject about that, but that was funny. Definitely a video worth checking out. Mindful future. Uh, yes, mindful future. If you are 200 years old, you are 200 years old chronologically. Let me see. How about the gray? That's this was something. This was something I had a I had a con. This, I had a question on, and they answered it. They answered the comment. They answered it. As you can see, um, kind of focus there. Mindful future, cool. Next comment. Yushimiro23. Sure, you are a utter complete idiot. Uh, we grew up watching him on TV. Yeah, this is, I made a comment about the barber and I made a joke about it. Uh, you know, I can deal with being called an idiot. That's cool. Another one by uh, Robert Dykus 78 Mmm, lovely name. Dykus? Okay, uh, what is the Dykus Syndrome? That was the dumbest shit I ever... I ever seen. I feel dumber than having watched the stupid shit. Well, my question to you is, if you felt dumb, you should have stopped watching it. For, for when you first saw the first part. You know? Uh, next one. Ryan. Let's see. What do we got here? Ryan. 99 Problems Remix. I guess it was some comment I left. 99 Problems Remix. Whatever. You know. Hello, Ryan. Next one. Comment on Life, God, and everything else. Let's see. 
and see comment on your video, like God and everything else. I see God as a higher version of like us. Is some some big game developer and we are the AI and he is like well he is like has a plan for us like we die and we're like a central higher plan of existence that is my gamers Stargate overall nerdy take on Christianity. I hope that makes sense to you like it did in my head. Yes. Well, I thank you, Burning Army Man. I definitely take your comment with the best intentions. Let's see, the um, next one is a uh, Gato Gato Sub. Comment on the Q Doma, one legged woman. I agree. All about the one legged woman and then some. Thank you, Ghetto Sub. I definitely appreciate your comment. Okay, the next one we have um, is by R Ryan Rayan 34X. Comment on the future of gaming. Number one, this will die. We will always have consoles. Number three, it will last. It's a form of entertainment just like movies. Four, virtual reality will have nothing to do with gaming if developers are serious enough. B, does a BTW, what's the name of the song? I'm, take, I'm talking about where gaming is going. That's what basically, yeah. Yeah, he, yeah, this is, this was his comment in regards to future of gaming. That was uh, another one of my love you videos. You should check it out sometime. Appreciate your comment. Comment. Rayan, definitely, definitely cool comment. Next one I'm going to here. Uh, pretty, pretty Brittany. Okay. Hi, I love your page. Hey, if you're interested in rap, you might want to check out this guy. He's a good friend of mine and really talented. If you like this vid, rate, comment, and subscribe, please. Thanks. I definitely appreciated it, and he is a good rapper, by the way, people. Next person we're going to activate activated videos. Let's see. They sent me something about the. I think they sent me a video with uh, dealing with UFOs or what have you. Yeah. Nothing bad there. Yahweh Hoff Hoffzol or whatever. They sent me something, a video. Uh, Yahweh Hoff Hoss with an S. They sent me another video. Okay, we're gonna go down, and we're gonna go to previous. Okay, we are we are working our way up. We are working our way up. Two thousand. Okay, two thousand eleven. The present. Okay, you know, they sent me another Yahweh, so-and-so sent me another one. Uh, Pretty Megan. Yeah, they sent me another, they sent me a comment if I like this, da 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 da, da. Even though I'm, I, I do believe Pretty Brittany and Pretty Megan are one and the same. They're real people, no one knows. You never know these days. You get all types of bots and stuff that come on here. Um, let's see. The Great Capricorn. I'm going to assume that's the Great Capricorn 82. He left a comment. Great video, Doma. I agree, too. As humans, we are to blame for our own destruction. We don't follow, even though we know the, na the natural order. Animals seem to do what they are supposed to do. Maintain the earth. But humans want to play God. Playing too much while, while in real life. And control nature and life. Human race is so fucked that we don't understand that we are all in the same boat. No matter what color, belief, rela relationship, or relation, we all are going to suffer the same beating. It's crazy. Thank you, thank you. I definitely appreciate your comment. Definitely, I found that to be most refreshing. Next, uh, we got another one. Same guy. Damn, Doma, you made the headline news sweet. Thanks again. 
Thanks again. The great. Uh, let's see, another one here. The Obama, let's see, the Obama, the, let's see, what is this? Comment on video. The Obama and drugs rumor, wow, people are funny. Just talk, yeah, okay. Yeah. And we got a lot from him. Laugh out loud, you're a funny dude. Da 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 da, okay. Um, okay, we're going to keep going up. We, like I said, pretty much all good comments from him. Um, we're going to go from, go to, uh, Grim Thang. Let's see. Grim Thang left me a comment. Uh, let's see. I think this, uh, this comment was, well, if you're an exact copy of your current self down to the neurological side, an exact copy would be just would be just you and all your memories and experiences. Thus would be the identical you and all its sense. Thank you, Grand Thang. I definitely appreciate that comment. Definitely. Very much, you know. That is the scientific aspect of me. Uh, this one is from Fila, I say Fee Cologne 1. If I'm saying that Fee Cologne one, if I'm saying that right. Uh, dear friend subscriber, this is a uh, paranoia activity two. We have an online release hard and lost footage. Yeah, 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 based on the actual footage. Yeah. This was definitely worth a look at. I liked it. Very cool. I, I do like paranormal stuff. Comment on interracial interracial profile. Almost Dutchman. Well, as you can see, you don't see no face. The only thing Baltimore police are good at is sniper rifle practice to protect and serve is a lie. Thank you, Almost Dutchman. I definitely appreciate your comment. Mayhem. I believe every word, especially the random stuff they block out, isn't even the is is even is not even bad. Nice job. I see. I'd even bad nice, okay. It's Q Q dot okay, Mayhem. Mayhem eight nine eight. Definitely appreciate your comment. Thank you. Halloween with Doma. Jesus Freak made my day. That was awesome. Mr. Mayhem, I appreciate it. It's kinda bad when you're carrying around pounds of a package on you, laugh out loud. That's it. Day Killer, Elephant Titus, God Doesn't Love You, that, that was uh, one of my videos, definitely cool comments there. Um, let me see, wow, you don't see this every day, old black man dancing to rock music on Easter Day, uh, definitely, uh, definitely a showstopper, a really big show, really big show, got, an, uh, got one, uh, another one here from Ryan, definitely. Yeah, OMG, amazing. This wasn't a video made by me, but I think this was one that was in my favorites or whatever. Uh, Incredibles Mouse 5. They commented on one of my uh, videos, My Crazy Mother and the Bible Stuff. I got a hard time getting through the ghetto talk. However, I respect your ability to think critically. Your questioning and skepticism of... The really, let's see, is uh, the of religion is to be applauded. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. All right, Shereen nine four three. Let's see, love your video. Keep them coming. How are you doing today? I think the video you have up today was total brilliance. You know, I really enjoyed it. If you're looking to get more subscribers, yeah, 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 okay, got that, all right. Freaking later, let's see, I was hoping you would check out my vid, hope you like it. This was not, this was like last month, probably gonna have to look at it. I don't think I truly looked looked at it, but, um, I'm, you know, he, he looks like he's a pretty good, he looks like he's good at what he does, from what I see. Now for the final and the number one video, Jaweave18. 
He looks like a definitely a kid. <clears throat> this was the stupid. This this is stupid. Why do you talk about shit you haven't even smoked? Weed or fake weed? No. Why the fuck do you think people? What's your opinion? And I say people think about your opinion. Blah, 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 blah. For shut. I say shut up. And you have no mind to the stupid. Da, 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 da. Okay. Ah, uh, yes, I left a lovely comment for him. You want to see what my comment was? Send comments. Okay. My comment, basically, to this, I left, uh, the title is, The Devil Knows Where You Live. You're funny for a child, and, and, and you feel like you're very proud of yourself for telling me to shut up. Ah, uh, but the one that's on my stage. Ah, uh, but the one that's on my stage. Uh, so you, uh, you, so you're gonna have to play by my rules. In a nutshell, hate me all you want to, but keep in mind, I am nothing yet. I am everything you wish you could be. You want to dislike me? Dislike me all you want. Because you know what? All you haters out there, you are the groundwork for my advancement. Literally. Call me ghetto, call me whatever. Say I can't talk and I can't convey myself. That's fine. That's fine. I appreciate the comments, you know. Not looking for fame or fortune, you know, all that good stuff, you know. I just put stuff up. I like to hear other people's opinions on things, you know. If you're wondering if it really irks me or hurt my feelings, no, it doesn't hurt my feelings, you know. I find it fascinating. I'm a studier of human nature and how people behave. You know, I like to get in people's heads and see what makes them do what they do. You know, it doesn't really surprise me. People are so predictable. And some of the things they do is not necessarily something that's under their own accord. Some people, they just do it. Because they just don't think. And you know the sad thing about it is, in many ways it's pathetic. But in other ways, it makes things interesting. We can't all be like Joe Weave, AJJ, whatever, 18. We can't all be like him. But, here's an example that we should all look at. Something that we don't want to be like. You don't want to be like him. We want to be better. And for some of those of y'all that feel, oh, you know, Q Dome is making an example of a, of a teenage boy. Hmm. Well, you know, I could care less. If he gets on the news, if he gets on the media, you know, that's fine, you know. If people want to throw stones and excommunicate me, mm, that's fine, too. You know, if you ask me, you know, am I really concerned about such things? No, probably not. You know, my comments on that subject would be, mm, the rest of the populace that are sheep to the slaughter can go to hell. And kiss my black ass. <laughs> anyway, this has been a this this has definitely been a Q Doma going through the memory lane of comments and all that good stuff. You know, I hadn't made a video in a while. You know, check it out. Whatever. You know. I'll be, I'll definitely, I definitely will be putting up some more videos. I've just been lazy and haven't been doing anything productive like I should be, you know. 
that's one of the issues, you know. When you know when people ask you the question, well, why haven't you done something? Don't make an excuse. Even if you think it's a good excuse, the whole thing is is to just do it. Anyway, this is Q Doma. Have good have a good afternoon, a good morning, and a good day. I'll see you in the future.